Yo, what's going on guys? Shake and Bake back and yes, today we got some more NBA free agency news and this one is not yet confirmed. It's not yet, uh, I guess, an official source. I will say that right now, but basically Carmelo Anthony has determined it's one of two teams that he's going to go to. It's either going to be the Bulls or the Knicks. He's pretty much said the Lakers are out of the running. That's what all the sources are saying. I'm not sure if it was his agent who told them that or if it was, hey, I, I, you know, I'm not thinking of them anymore. But, uh, yeah, that's what every source is saying right now. They, it, ESPN has confirmed it and everything like that. So, yeah, I wanted to talk about this. I talked about the LeBron one right before it was going to go down the next day. And, yeah, I, I, I think this could be the best destination for Carmelo Anthony. I said this before. Carmelo Anthony, great player amazing score and Chicago really could use that they are they're already a great team they already made the playoffs this year I mean they really didn't have much of a chance against the Wizards Wizards are a great squad and uh yeah they they're really building too but that's the thing Carmelo Anthony he needs some teammates he needs some help it's the NBA now where you know you need good teammates it's not just you know hey let me stay here for the whole career let me just you know fight off everyone else not go anywhere else will build around me. It, it hasn't become that anymore. Now the NBA has become, let's grab a few guys, a couple superstars. I think I just said superstars, but you grab a couple guys and build a nucleus around them of bench players and role players, unless you're, eh, even the Spurs have kind of done that. I mean, they've built around their big three, grabbing guys, making a few trades, and now basically you're going to try and do the same with maybe Joakim Noah, Derek Rose, and Carmelo Anthony, who could be the last piece of the puzzle for uh, Chicago. But they're also saying that uh, Chicago has interest in now free agent Dwayne Wade, who, I mean, who knows what he could do. Does he really want to keep playing in Miami? I mean, obviously Miami's going to give him a great contract. I don't think they're going to give him a really long-term deal, especially if he's the only one going back there, because... I mean, do you really want to keep D. Wade? I, I know he's your franchise, he's the face, but are you going to be able to keep him for years and years and give him so much money if you're just rebuilding? I mean, are you paying him just out of respect or what's going on there? I'm not sure, but it'll be interesting because, I mean, there are people who want Dwayne Wade. They would love to have him. Can you imagine this team if they could grab Melo and Wade? The Eastern Conference Finals? What if it was the Cavs and the Bulls? It would be insane. This would be just crazy because right now, I mean, the Cavs, they ain't done. They're still trying to move pieces. They're still trying to make sure they get Brendan Hayward. So there is still a lot to be done with free agency. It, nothing is decided yet. Nothing is finalized. You can still compete. You can still get plenty of talent. And that's what I guess the Bulls are looking to do. And, of course, if they don't end up getting mellow, they're probably going to look at some other guys. But I still think if you're Carmelo Anthony... Even though you can get more money with the Knicks, you can get that five-year deal, more guaranteed money, you can stay there where you're from, but I just see him going to Chicago. I think that's the best place for him, and personally, I would like to see that. That's what I want to see. I want to see the Cavaliers and the Bulls battling it out. There's so many good teams now in the East building up. I said the Wizards before are still a strong team. The Raptors are still a strong team. The Nets are clinging on to the... What they've got, I don't think they're going to be a strong team for much longer, especially if Paul Pierce leaves. And, yeah, their team is looking a little, little sad. But the East has still got a few strong teams, and it's looking like it could get even stronger for some of those teams. But, yeah, I want to know, what do you guys think down in the comment section below? Will Carmelo Anthony go to the Knicks, or will he go to the Bulls? I don't know why I said that super slow, but, yeah, I, I got him going to the Bulls. It's still a few days left, hashtag before Melo decides. You can still get out some good jokes with that, but uh, I definitely don't think uh, the, the Kermit memes, I don't think he'll finish his tea before LeBron, or uh, LeBron's already decided, so <laughs> let me just butcher this joke even more. It's terrible, yeah. Just, just, just act like I didn't say that. Just remember, I think he's going to Chicago. I hope he goes there, and uh, yeah, we'll have to see how it develops over free agency for the last few days of, I guess, the big, big signings. And uh, then we'll see where the rest of the dominoes fall, like the Dwayne Wade and the other players like that. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed.